Like, uh, scoreboard on my bullshit like Jordan is up like an ornament, cash in the audience. Money bags on the way like I Y'all already know what's happening. You're watching Worldwide Spotlight Early Morning Vibes. Back to back videos going down. Keep checking the channel. Let's go to the comment section. <laughs> This man right here is trying to disrespect mans for no reason. Oh, rich homie Quan has over 11 million views, more than this channel will ever What are you talking about, dog? What are you really talking about? First of all, I deleted a thousand videos, over 40 million views on this channel. And I still have 40 million views on this channel. So don't talk to me about a small, tiny, little 11 million views. Say it's actually gross that a man like me with million, almost a hundred million views would even respond to a bootleg man in the comment section that can't even get one view, right? Now on some real talks, black people are embarrassing. So I'm packing my stuff and I'm moving back to Africa. I can teach finance and I'm about my chick. You better come correct. This is the thing, when a black person has a beef with any other nationality, the most a man's gonna do is hop on the internet and start gang banging on the keyboard. Niggas gang banging on the keyboard. Gang banging on the keyboard. Niggas catching bodies on the keyboards. Trick a finger on the keyboard. That's the extent to it. But if a black man has a problem with another black man, Mans are sliding, dropping the window switch, da 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 da. Mans are dropping from helicopters, snipers on the roof, grenades, all of that, right? First little back street, straight up out the yeah, yeah. Everybody got a blick and they with it, yeah, yeah. How is it possible that these mans right here posted up on the block, started calling black people all types of names, and not one man confronted them? to say, yo, stop that. We <laughs> got the best you got. Best you got. Feed in the water. Feed in the water. We got the Bloods, the Crips, the G, a whole bunch of mans. And they're all acting like they don't see that this is happening. But if I posted up close to those mans that were holding those flags and talking all that trash, went on IG, I said, yo, the Bloods and the Crips, there's some waste mans, bro. Pull up right now. Pull up right now. Within three or four minutes, mans are gonna pull up that Little Caesars pizza, hot and ready, busting shot Swiss cheese, right? Drive right past the mans, holding the flags, talking trash, and then wet me up. One Blood, from the comment section, saw what was going on. He has a car, he has registration and insurance. He can easily drive there, confront a man and say, yo, stop saying that. Instead, the man hopped on the internet and started Niggas gang banging on the keyboard. Gang banging on the keyboard. Niggas catching bodies on the keyboards. Oh, why don't you do that in Compton, dog? Why don't you guys go to Compton and come do that, dog? Bro, they're already outside. This man said come to Compton and see what's up. Let's see what's going on in Compton right now. A bunch of bloods beating up each other, rolling on the floor. So you're telling me you have all those mans there and not one man can take a bus to go confront those people and say, yo, stop saying that? I guarantee all those mans with those flags can march right through Compton with the flags talking trash and the bloods are just gonna be like, yo, what are they doing over there? Yo, Pookie, where's my money, dog? Where's my money, dog? And parade right through there and mans are not gonna say nothing and for that reason I'm gonna help rapper Slim Thugger build that ship and we're going back to Africa we moving back to Africa we gonna switch this shit up all right so that's what we finna do right fuck the bullshit right so we know the story 
Them motherfuckers drug us over here on some slave shit. Now we going back. We going to get out with another ship and we going back to that motherfucker and we going to start. Trying to hide all that ass. She got all kind of equipment trying to block all that ass. But we still see it, boo. Yeah. Anyway, we moving over there. Africa is so big of a continent that we just gonna pick a spot that's by the water. I've been to Seychelles, that shit fly. There's plenty of open land out there and that shit ain't gonna be that expensive, right? So I'm gonna go out there, how many acres we need for a whole country? What you how think? How many acres? For a whole country. <laughs> <laughs> how many acres we need for a whole country? Somebody Google that. <laughs> Cause what we doing is, how, how many acres is America? Damn. How many acres it is in America? We finna go get, we finna find some water out there, right? We gonna line that bitch up and decorate that hoe just like America. And it's gonna be Africa, America. Nigga, stop buying cars and go buy an island, nigga. All those people at the border that can't really get in, if you know how to do drywall and all that stuff, you can come too. All I'm saying, that could never, ever happen anywhere near me, bro. I'll go there and say, yo, what did you say, bro? What? You watch your worldwide spotlight, like button, sub button. I got videos going down all day. Live spotlight, pull up. You got one round in you, then man's gonna be on the floor. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Then man's gonna be on the floor. Then man's gonna be on the floor. Then man's gonna be on the floor. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt. Cause man's is salt.